In this video, I'll show you how to get the three servit mounts available from the Protoform Synthesis system in patch 9.2 Eternity Zend. I'll show you where to obtain the schematics and where to find the materials needed to craft the specific mounts. To begin with, I want to make sure that you've already unlocked the Protoform Synthesis Forge, as you won't be able to obtain any schematics for the Forge if you haven't already unlocked it. I've made a separate video explaining step by step how to unlock it, so I suggest you check that one out if you haven't already unlocked the system. With that out of the way, let's begin. First mount will be the Death Runner mount, and this one doesn't require a lot of explanation, as you probably already obtained it, because you obtained it by simply unlocking the Protoform Synthesis Forge. In the last quest, you will receive the schematics and all materials needed to craft the mount. Next up, we have the Pale Regal Servit. The schematics for this mount is obtained by completing the achievement called Cypher of the First Ones, which requires you to unlock all Cypher skills from the Cypher console located in Exiles Hollow. You can get the Cyphers of the First Ones that you need to unlock the skills from Daily Quests, World Quests, Treasures and Raspawns. The materials needed to craft the Pale Regal Servit are 400 Genesis Modes, 1 Servit Lattice and 1 Protoform Sentient Crown. Let's start off with the Genesis modes. These bad boys will be the primary farm for most mounts. They drop off all animal-like beings in Seraph Mortis, like Vespoids, Devourers, Servits, Vombatas, Tarachnids, Helicid, Buffonid, and Raptorus, and a couple others. Almost all mobs drop one to two each. The best spot I found was right here, just south of Pilgrim's Grace. There's a big Vespoid hive located here, and there's a ton of Vespoid mobs that are packed and very easy to kill. They don't guarantee drop the modes, but there are so many mobs that it's probably still the best place to do this. To obtain a Servit Lattice, you'll have to kill Servit creatures. Ordinary Servit mobs have a low chance of dropping one, probably around 5% drop chance. If you want a higher drop chance, you can kill Chitali, the eldest, which is a Servit respawn located right here. To obtain the Protoform Sentience Crown, you have to kill Automa and Jiro mobs. Elites seem to have a higher drop chance as far as I've experienced, but it's still about 1-5%. to I suggest going to Antecedent Isle and farm the Elite Automas around the Isle. Lastly, we have the Sundered Serith Steed. The schematics for this Servit Mount is found on the ground next to a Morsworn Cache located right here. It'll be surrounded by some non-elite Morsworn that are very easily soluble, that won't be a problem for you. Once you've obtained the schematics, return to the Protoform Synthesis Forge and turn in the schematics. You've now learned how to create the mount and the materials required for this mount is 300 Genesis Motes, 1 Servit Lattice and 1 Morforged Bridle. The Morforged Bridle has actually not even been found yet, so I can't let you in on any details as of how to get this item. I will however have the information in a pinned comment and in the description as soon as it has been found. And that is it for this video. I can also recommend checking my channel for more 9.2 mount guides. Thank you very much for watching. Congratulations on your new mounts. Please leave a like, subscribe and throw a comment for Mr. Algorithm as it helps me out a ton. And as always, have a wonderful day. Bye.